Hello and welcome to Add to Cart. This is Brian and I've got a different kind of video for today. It's not something that a specific thing that I'm going to review and say go here and buy this or add this to your cart. But if you're a handyman and you want to be, you're in the market for new stuff or maybe you're a new handyman and maybe you don't know what to have. This is the video for you because I'm going to show you what you need to be a good handyman. And, um, you know, I can brag and tell you all about the stuff that I've created. Uh, barns and sheds and remodeled ceilings and kitchens and sinks and all the countertops, uh, building furniture. Anyway, we could go on and on and on. But I think you're mainly here to watch and say, if I'm going to get a tool belt, what kind of tool belt and what should I put in that tool belt? Things that you actually need. Here is your video. This is my tool belt and things that I've used over 20 years of experience. Things that you must have inside your tool belt. A square. I know that looks like a triangle, but that's called a square. So you can make things square. Does that make sense? Get you a good one. This one's metal. I uh, love it. I uh, used it for 20 something years. Great, great thing to have. Uh, always want to have a chisel of some kind. And of course, a marker. I like these Sharpies that pop in and out. Um, good one to have. So things on your left side of your tool belt, at least on mine anyway. Of course, you want to have a tape measure. And tape measure. I personally love Stanley. It's a lever lock and uh, it doesn't go in unless you press the button. When you press the button, that is when it retracts. Had this for over 30 years. Absolutely love this Stanley tape measure. Had a, again, any project I grab is what I'm doing. Uh, get you a hole punch. Good thing to have. They are fabulous for marking things on the wood, marking things on metal. Um, you always need a hole punch. It's a good thing to have. Get you, of course, you need some kind of a blade. Uh, this is a utility knife from Stanley. I like the nice metal ones, not the, not the flimsy plastic ones. Uh, these things, you can take these out and replace the blades. Great thing to have. Always make sure you have one of those. Of course, you need some kind of a marking utensil. Uh, pencils, I've got different sizes. So always take them with me. Um, this one's nice because I just whittle it down when I need it. Uh, this one just happens to be in there because you know, it was, I needed something a little bit finer in that situation. Uh, and then of course you've got your pockets for storing screws and nails and, and all kinds of things. I usually put the smaller ones. Of course the sawdust ends up piling up inside of your, <laughs> your pouches because as you're working. Uh, this one right here is something that I think you should grab. This is great. Uh, I love this, especially when I'm working outdoors or up high on a ladder. This one here is a, a Werner and it's a, uh, I don't even know really have a name for it, but what it does is it holds your your tool on your belt. So that's on your belt and you hook that. It's really easy to just flip it in there. Uh, just one handed, you reach down and just fall that in there. And that holds your tools, any kind of tool you have, you just grab this little, this is a, of course a little bungee cord, it's got a little knot on the end of it, a little plastic ball and it just slips inside there and you're set to go. So excellent thing to have with you and of course I like suspenders on my tool belt uh, because it holds all the weight uh, you're not holding it all on your hips you're holding it all on your shoulders it's, it's way better so if you're a handyman or, a, or a, an aspiring handyman these are some of the things that I would suggest you put in your tool belt hopefully you can find you know whatever sources you like to add those things to your cart thanks for watching add to cart if this video helped you out, go ahead and give me a like, give me a share, tell your friends. I appreciate it.